Well, we're very excited. So, I mean, I feel like we're almost on the eve of going recreational. Uh, I think within a matter of next week or two. Kaveh Azade and his medical marijuana cultivation facility, King City Gardens, is one of the cultivators that was awarded a provisional license by the state. They've awarded probably about 75, 80 or so provisional licenses. There is still a laundry list of items that we need to uh, complete and, and verify. That list includes things like upgrading their systems to process sales and increase security. Security is a big one of them. Your standard uh, processes, you know, getting some letters from this, your respective cities uh, from the police chief and making sure everything up to code. Azadeh says the next step is figuring out exactly where different sites will be. For this group of applicants, it will be decided through a lottery system. Last week, they did the lottery system for all the dispensaries. So there was about 339 uh, lottery balls that went out. They have until Friday to submit potential sites. Each cultivator gets three locations. Each dispensary gets one. Azadi says each location must be at least a mile apart. But he's optimistic it's all going to come together sooner rather than later. From based on what I'm seeing with the amount of things we need to go through, I think in the next two weeks, maybe three weeks, uh, it should be live for the majority of dispensaries and cultivators. Azadeh says there are still more questions to be answered as the state continues to roll out of the program. Decisions still need to be made about how companies can market and package their products. Sure, you can stop watching, but let's be honest, you want to know more. Tap the links or even better, click subscribe to stay in the know.